I'm Dr. Renard, and sustainability is something that's very close to my heart. I've been involved in this industry for more than a decade now, renewable energy and even converting waste to energy type of project. I'm excited to test drive the Mercedes-Benz EQS 500. It's so luxurious and classy that I've almost forgotten that it's a green product. And also to check out the cycle and carriage Matera Damansara to discover what are some of the sustainability initiatives they have put in place. The car in itself is such a sophisticated machine. One of the things that I was really impressed by was the coverage of the range and it also has this HEPA air quality filter. What's also good to know is that Cycle and Carriage has all the expertise to ensure that the car's always in top condition. But what about it, you know, from an operational side? Does Cycle and Carriage have sustainability efforts in place? I'm about to find out. During my tour, I've learned that all Cycle and Carriage branches have sustainability practices in place. The Mutera Damansara branch in particular has achieved a silver rating by Green RE. It means that this branch needs to demonstrate innovative features, efficient use of resources and materials, it needs to focus on waste minimization efforts, and the use of natural and LED lights. This is one of the few branches that have also employed the use of solar panels, which I believe is the way of the future. Personally, seeing all of these practices gives me so much more confidence in Cycle and Carriage as a brand that truly walks the talk and is looking towards creating a better, more sustainable future.